Hi, I'm Debbie from Simply Overland and as many of you know we live in a 6x6 truck called Dudu. I've had a lot of questions recently about where's the bed. We deliberately hid the bed because we wanted to have a sense of a daytime space and a separate nighttime space. Plus we didn't really have the height to have a drop down bed because our seating area sits on top of our water tank. Um, so our bed actually sits behind this wall and it's fully made up. I'm I'm going to give you a quick demonstration of how it works but it works for us it's super simple so we have this lovely area which is quite big where we can sit and relax during the day or we can eat play games in the evenings and then at night we just lift this down and it's a very easy way of changing the feeling of our living space and also it means that you know the bed can be a little bit messy or we can have our laundry in there perhaps really we don't have to show it if somebody comes in we don't have to always have a pristinely made bed because sometimes we don't. Anyway let me just show you the first thing we do is we clear anything that's on the table because the bed actually comes down over the table although it doesn't sit on it. Behind these cushions we have some aluminium rails and the bed actually rests on those. So I'm going to show you and it's very simple. So it's just a simple case of moving the cushions, putting them under the table and tilting forward the backrests which just sit on top of the seating cushions. You can see the two railings that the bed will fold down onto. Then it's just a simple case of unclipping the wall and letting it lower down. As you can see the bed is made up. And then we usually just pull the mattress forward. There are There is a gap underneath those cupboards at the back so the mattress can slide under there when we fold it away. Simple as that. Um, what we particularly like is that it is a full length, it's uh, six foot long and we can fully sit up in bed which we both actually really like. All of the three cupboards at the back have sliding doors and they hold all of our clothes. Um, the middle one has a USB port or two and um, a light switch for the LED lights. It really is as simple as that and when it's time to put the bed back up again we just fold the duvet under, we push, we allow the air to come out and then it's as simple as just clicking either side, putting the cushions back in play and voila we have a living room. Now this setup works very well for us, we know it's not for everybody but we really feel that the compromise in the slight shortening of our living space during the day is worth it for having that sense of a separate room at night. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, um, or if you have any questions, please do let us know. We'll try and reply to everything. Give us a thumbs up and a subscribe.